Hello students. Today we're going to talk about the body. We're going to look at all of the body and the parts. Now first we're going to talk about the head. So here comes some beautiful art. All right. Now this is the head. That's the head. We're going to talk about the face first the face. First we have the mouth. The mouth. This is the mouth. All right, it's the mouth. Now in the mouth we have lips. Lips. One lip, two lips, lip, lips, okay? Also in the mouth we have teeth. All right, now one is tooth, one tooth, one tooth. Many is teeth. Teeth. This one is special, okay? Tooth, teeth. And then finally, we have the tongue. The tongue. Tongue. All right? So for the mouth, we have lip, lips, tooth, teeth, and tongue. Okay, now let's add to the face. Let's give the nose. There's the nose. <laughs> it's a beautiful nose. All right? Nose. All right? Nose. Then we have the forehead. This is the forehead. Forehead. Head. Forehead. All right? So we have the nose, the forehead, and then we have the eyes. 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 One eye. I, two eyes. I, eyes. Now, over the eyes, we have the eyebrow. 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 We have two eyebrows. Okay, one eyebrow, two eyebrows. Now, on this beautiful face, we have the cheeks. Cheeks. Cheek, one cheek, one cheek, two cheeks. Okay, cheek and cheeks. Next, we have the chin, the chin, chin. We have one chin. After this, of course, we need hair, beautiful hair. Okay, this is the hair. And finally, we have ears. One ear, ear, one ear, and two ears. Ear, ears. Okay, so now we have the face, the hair, ear, eyebrow, 
cheek, chin, nose, eye, forehead. Now, let's talk about the whole body. More beautiful art is coming. All right, now, we already saw the head. Let's give it some character. All right, and then we'll give it some features. And I will tell you, three, four, what these are. And one, two, three, four, five. This is a monster, but that's okay. <laughs> it's beautiful, isn't it? Oh, we forgot the hand here. All right, now, this is why I'm not an art teacher. Now, here we go. This is the neck. 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 All right, here's the neck. Next we have the shoulder. Shoulder. We have two shoulders. Shoulders. Okay? One shoulder, two shoulders. After that, we have the back. This is the back. Now, you can't see it, so we'll do it like this. Back. Next, we have the chest. This is the chest. Chest. This is the chest. After that, we have the stomach. 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 And then we have the arm. The arm. All right? Now let's look at what we have so far of the body. We have the neck. The neck. The shoulder the shoulder, the back, the back, the arm, the arm, the chest, the chest, and the stomach, the stomach. All right, now let's add more to this beautiful body. Now, here we have the elbow. This is the elbow. Right here is the elbow. We have two elbows. One elbow, another elbow. Elbow and elbows. Look, L, L. <laughs> All right, and here we have a wrist. Now, wrist. We don't say the W, we only say the R, wrist, wrist, all right? So again, we have the elbow, the elbow, and we have the wrist, the wrist. Okay, now let's look some more at this beautiful body. Let's look at the hand, all right? This is the hand the hand. This is the thumb. This isn't a very good thumb, is it? Let me see. Let me, this is the thumb. 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 And this is a finger. 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 Okay? These are all fingers, but this is a special one. Thumb and fingers. We have 10 fingers. All right, so if we look on the monitor and look at the hand, we have the hand, the thumb, the thumb, and the finger, finger. Okay? Now, let's look at the leg. All right? Now, this is the leg. Leg leg. This part 
This part is the thigh. 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 Okay, this is the thigh. Then we have the knee. Knee. Now, remember, for pronunciation, we don't say the k. We just say knee. Knee. All right? And then here we have the ankle. Ankle. This is the ankle here. All right? So if we look at the leg again, we have the thigh, the thigh, the knee, knee, and the ankle, the ankle. And then finally, we have the foot. This is one foot, two feet, it's like tooth and teeth, foot and feet. This is the foot. And on the foot, we have toe, toe, okay? Plural is toes. We have ten toes. Now, again, we have the foot and the toe, the toe. Now, you also need to know right, right, and left. All right, this is my right, my left, all right? Right, left, right, and left, all right? You got it? Now, we're going to practice with our assistants, and you do it too. I want you to point, point, all right? Are you ready, assistants? All right. Now, I want you to point to your nose. Point to your nose. All right. Now, point to your forehead. Point to your forehead. Yes, good. Point to your mouth. Point to your mouth. All right. Point to your right cheek. Point to your right cheek. Now, point to your chin. Point to your chin. Good. Now, point to your left elbow. Left elbow. Okay, you're doing it too, right? Now, point to your right shoulder. Right shoulder, yes. Point to your right knee. Your right knee. Yes. Next, point to your left ankle. Your left ankle. Yes. And point to your left foot. Your left foot. Yes. Good. All right. Very good. Now, let's look at the monitor and I'm going to ask our assistants to answer some questions. You also answer the questions. First, Ali, what's this? It's an arm. And what's this? It's an elbow. It's an elbow. What's this? It's a wrist. Yes, very good. What's this? It's a hand. It's a hand. What are these? They are fingers. They are fingers. Good. All right, Isabel, you're next. What's this? It's a leg. Yes, that's right. What's this? It's a knee. Spell it. K-N-E-E. -E. Yes, very good. And what's this? It's an ankle. Yes, that's right. And what's this? It's foot. What are these? Their toes. Yes, great. Susan, what's this? It is a back. Yes, that's right. What's this? It is a shoulder. Yes. What's this? It is the chest. Yes. And what's this? It is the stomach. Yes, very good. Thank you. 
makeup, and jewelry. Let's talk about makeup and jewelry. This is interesting for men and women. Now, first, we'll talk about the face. Now, here's again the beautiful face. Here's the face. First, the eyes. The eyes. There. Kind of strange eyes. All right. Now, first, here is the vocabulary eye shadow. Eye shadow, eye liner, eye liner, mascara, 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 and eyebrow color. Eyebrow color. Okay, so again, we have eyeshadow, eyeliner, mascara, and eyebrow color. Now, let's do the eyes first. This is going to be beautiful. All right, first we put on eyeliner. Eyeliner, beautiful. All right, here's lovely eyeliner. Okay, I'm a makeup artist too. <laughs> There's eyeliner. Now, let's use red, because that's the other color we have. Now, we have eyeshadow, eyeshadow, right? This is the eyeshadow. Now, we have mascara, mascara here, mascara, mascara, all right? And we can put some mascara here. Okay, this is the mascara. And it's looking pretty good so far, huh? All right, now we need some eyebrow color. Here's the eyebrows. Here's the eyebrows. But they need color. So, eyebrow color. There, wow. Beautiful eyebrows. Okay, so, so far we have beautiful eyes with eye sh eyeliner, eyeshadow, mascara, and eyebrow color. Now, let's do the mouth, all right? Uh, let's do the vocabulary first for the mouth. We have lip liner, lip liner, and we have lipstick. Okay, lip liner and lipstick. Now, here we go. We're going to first draw around the mouth with lip liner. So here's the lip liner, all right? There, beautiful lip liner. Lovely, huh? Now, we need the lipstick, the lipstick. So here's the lipstick. Uh, it's not very good, <laughs> but it'll do, all right? So here's the lipstick. Lipstick, so lip liner and lipstick. Now, we have to do something with the cheeks. So here is the vocabulary for the cheeks. We have rouge. Rouge. So we'll put on a little rouge. All right. Now, here is the rouge for the cheeks. All right. There's the beautiful rouge for the cheeks. What a beautiful girl. But let's give her a nose, too. All right. There's a beautiful girl with her makeup. Let's give her some hair. There. <laughs> All right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so here are some questions for the assistants. Now, let's start with Susan. Susan, do you wear lipstick? Yes, I do. What color do you wear? Mm, 
I usually wear red. All right. Isabel, do you wear eyeshadow? Yes, I do. Do you wear mascara? Yes, I do. Ali, do you wear mascara? No, I don't. Does Tarkan wear mascara? Yes, he does. Does he wear lipstick? Maybe. Thank you. Very good. Now it's time to look and listen. Look and listen. She puts lipstick on her lips. She puts eyeshadow on her eyes. Now her lips are red. Her cheeks are pink. Read and repeat. Now, let's give this beautiful woman some jewelry. Now, first we're going to give her earrings. I guess first we have to give her ears. Okay, here's ears. Now, we're going to give her earrings. Ear rings. It's two words together. Ear and ring. Ear rings. So, let me see. Lovely earrings. Okay? Because there are two. One, two, usually. All right? So, now, uh, first we have to give her a neck. And let's give her a red necklace. All right? This is a necklace. Okay? Notice neck. Necklace. All right, let's see. Let's see. <laughs> Here's a beautiful red necklace for our beautiful woman, a necklace, okay? This is a necklace and earrings, all right? So a necklace and earrings. What a beautiful girl. Now, let's ask you some questions. Susan, do you wear earrings? Yes, I do. Are you wearing earrings now? No. All right. Isabel, are you wearing a necklace? Yes, I am. Ali, do you wear earrings? No, but my friend wears one. Ali, here is a word for you. Chain. Chain. Men don't wear necklaces. They wear chains. So. Do you wear a chain? No, I don't. All right, okay. Now, Susan, do I wear earrings? Yes, you do. Am I wearing earrings now? Yes, you are. Isabel, do I wear necklaces? Yes, you do. Am I wearing one now? Yes, you are. All right, good job, thank you. Now, we're going to look at some real photos, and the assistants will tell us about them. So, here we go. Ali, you're going to begin. Ali, is she wearing earrings? Yes, she is. Are her earrings in her ears? Yes, they are. Susan, is she wearing a necklace? Yes, she is. Is her necklace around her neck? Yes, it is. Isabel, is she wearing eyeshadow? Yes, she is. Is she wearing mascara? Yes, she is. Okay, now here's another photo and we'll ask questions about this handsome man. All right. Now, this is a man, Ali. I want you to tell me about his face. He is good looking, he is young, he has a mustache, 
He doesn't have a beard. He is wearing one earring. He is not wearing a mascara or eyeshadow. Yes, that's right. Okay, now we'll look at another photo and Isabel will answer questions about this one. So, Isabel, tell us about this photo. She is middle-aged. Uh, she is attractive. She is wearing eyeshadow and mascara. She is wearing lipstick. She is wearing earrings and a necklace. All right, okay. Now, one last photo, and Susan will do this. You tell us about this person. She's young. She's pretty. She's uh, wearing eyeshadow and uh, mascara. She's wearing a red lipstick. She's wearing a lot of earrings. And teacher, what's that? That is a nose ring. Okay, she's wearing a nose ring. Yes, good job. All right, now it's time to look and listen. Look and listen. She is wearing earrings. She isn't wearing a necklace. He is wearing an earring. He is wearing a chain. They are not wearing nose rings. Read and repeat. All right, now let's look at some vocabulary to take care of our body. First, Brush your teeth. Brush your teeth. Next, comb your hair. Comb your hair, okay? Also, brush your hair. Brush your hair. Shave, shave, take a bath, take a bath, take a bath, or take a shower, take a shower. Next one, wash your face. Wash your face. Wash your hair. Wash your hair. Cut your hair. Cut your hair. All right, so again, we have brush your teeth, comb your hair, brush your hair, shave, take a bath, take a shower, wash your face, wash your hair, and cut your hair. Okay? Now, let's practice with these a little bit. And we're going to look at some pictures, and I will ask the assistants some questions about them. Starting with Susan. Now, Susan, what is she doing? She is brushing her hair. Is her hair long or short? It is long. Yes. Now, another photo for Isabel. Isabel, what is he doing? He is shaving. Does he have a beard? No, he doesn't. Does he have a mustache? No, he doesn't. All right. Now, Ali, a picture for you. Ali, what is she doing? 
She is putting on lipstick. What color is it? It's pink. Is she pretty? Yes, she is. Yes. Okay, another photo, another picture for Isabel. What is he doing? He is cutting her hair. Is her hair long or short? It's long. All right. Okay, another picture for Susan. All right, Susan, what is he doing? He is brushing his teeth. Yes, that's good. It's a very healthy thing. Now, another picture for Ali. Ali, what is he doing? He is taking a shower. Is he clean? Yes, he is. All right. Very good. Thank you very much. Okay. Now it's time to look and listen. Look and listen. She is washing her face. She is combing her hair. She is cutting my hair. He is not shaving. You are brushing your teeth. Read and repeat. Now, let's talk about some more vocabulary for jewelry. Now, here's a, here are some new words. Bracelet. Bracelet. Ring. Ring. Watch. Watch. Anklet anklet and piercing this is a piercing I don't have any piercings here okay again bracelet ring watch anklet and piercing okay now let's look at some photos again and tell you tell me what they are wearing or what they are doing. So Susan, let's start with you and you tell us about this photo. She is young. She is wearing a short t-shirt. She has a piercing in her stomach. Yeah, Susan, that is called a belly button. Okay. Okay. She has a piercing in her belly button. Mm -hmm. She has uh, wearing a lot of Bracelets. She is wearing a lot of she bracelets. Is wearing a lot of bracelets. She is. She has a lot of rings on her fingers. Yes. And she has a chain. All right, Isabel. Here's a picture for you. All right. Tell us about him. Okay. He is young. He has a small beard, but he doesn't have a mustache. He is wearing one earring and he has a piercing in his eyebrow. He is wearing a necklace and some bracelets and he is wearing two rings. Is he wearing a watch? Yes, he is. Okay, all right. Okay, Ali, you're next. Tell us about this person. She is wearing a lot of jewelry. She is wearing earrings. And she's wearing some rings. She's wearing a nose ring. She's wearing a lot of necklaces and a lot of bracelets. She is wearing an anklet. She's not wearing a piercing. All right, very good. Okay, now it's time to look and listen. Look and listen. They are wearing bracelets. She is wearing an anklet. We are not wearing a piercing. 
He is not wearing a watch. You are not wearing a ring. Read and repeat. Now, let's get back to the body. And I'm going to ask you some questions. So, first of all, Ali, how many arms do you have? I have two arms. All right. Isabel, how many heads do you have? I have one hat. Yes, that's right. Isabel, you ask Susan. Susan, how many fingers do you have? I have ten fingers. Susan, ask Ali. Ali. How many toes do you have? I have ten toes. <laughs> but we can't see them. <laughs> okay. Ali, ask Isabel. Isabel, how many legs do you have? I have two legs. Yes. Okay, Susan. How many legs do we have? Mm, we have eight legs. That's right. Ali, how many heads do we have? Four. Yes. And Isabel, how many shoulders do we have? Eight. Now, you ask Susan. Susan, how many eyes do we have? We have eight eyes. Mm -hmm. All right. Now, you ask Ali, Susan. Ali, how many ears do we have? We have eight ears. And ask Isabel. Isabel, how many bags do we have? We have four bags. Ask Susan. Susan, how many chicks do we have? We have eight chicks. Ask Ali. Ali, how many teeth do we have? I don't know. A lot. Yes, we are a monster. All right, good job. Pronunciation. Now, let's work on some more pronunciation. Today, we're going to do two sounds, short I, I, and long E, E, okay? Now, first, let's look at some words with the short I sound, I. Here we go. Lip, lip, it, it, him, him, sit, sit, list, list, live, live, thin, thin, his, his. Okay, again, lip, it, him, sit, list, live, thin, his. Notice when we write the words, when we spell them, it's usually with I, I, okay, in all of these. Now, let's look at some words with the E sound. Here we go. Knee, knee. B, B, eat, eat, three, three, cheek, cheek, ear, ear, feet, feet, and sleep. Sleep. Now, look at how we spell them. Now, B is special, okay? But if we look at some of the other ones, you can see that this is usually E, E, 
E, E, E. Easy, E. Okay, now, we have EA here. Now, EA can go two ways. Today, we'll only talk about the E sound of this, but there is another one. Okay, now again, knee, B, eat, three, cheek, ear, feet, and sleep. Now, we've seen the different spellings here, so here are some other spellings with the E sound. Ski, ski, people, people, key, key, believe, believe, and receive, receive. Okay? Now, if you look at these, these all have the E sound, but they're different spelling. This one is very special. Okay? All right? So, again, the long E sound, ski, people, key, believe, receive. Okay? Now, let's practice short I, I, and E. Don't worry about the meanings of the words. We're just doing this for the sounds. We'll do these one by one, and you practice at home, okay? So you listen and say at home. Now, let's start with the I sounds. We have I. All right, here we go. It it, rich, rich, sit, sit, fit, fit, bit, bit, dip, dip, lip, lip, Tim, Tim, Hill, Hill, Sin, Sin, and Live, Live. Okay, so let's go down these again. You say them with me at home. It, Rich, Sit, Fit. Bit, dip, lip, tim, hill, sin, live. All right? It, 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 it. Okay, now let's do the E sound. And look at the spelling as I write them. Here we go. Eat, eat, reach. Reach, seat, seat, feet, feet, beat, beat, deep, deep, leap, leap, team, team, Heel, heel, seen, seen, and leave. Okay? So again, eat, reach, seat, feet, beat, deep, leap, team, heel, seen, leave. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to go across this way and you can hear the sounds. 
Are you ready? You practice these at home. Already? It, eat. Rich, reach. Sit, seat. Fit, feet. Bit, beat. Dip, deep. Lip, leap. Tim, team. Hill, heel. Sin, seen. Live, leave. Okay? All right. Very good. Now, let's practice these words, some of these words, in some sentences. And we'll do these one by one, and then we'll have the assistants help us here. All right. Now, here's the first sentence. They're kind of silly, but that's okay. All right. Here's one. We use our knees when we ski. We use our knees when we ski. Okay, Susan, you try it. We use our knees when we ski. Yes, good. Okay, here's another one. He sits and eats his big dinner. He sits and eats his big dinner. Okay, Ali, you try. He sits and eats his big dinner. Yes, good. All right. His big feet don't fit these little shoes. His big feet don't fit these little shoes. Okay, Isabel? His big feet don't fit these little shoes. Mm -hmm. These. These. Uh huh. These little shoes. All right? His big feet don't fit these little shoes. Okay, another one. Tim's team is fifth on this list. All right? Okay, Susan. Tim's team is fifth on this list. Yes, good. Okay, and five, we don't have three lips. All right, Isabel, you do this one. We don't have three lips. Three. Three. We don't have three lips. We don't have three lips. Yes, and it's a good thing too. All right, very good. Now, let's listen and write. Listen and write. Listen and write these words. Number one, knee. Knee. Number two, shoulder. Shoulder. Number three, stomach. Stomach. Number four, foot. Foot. Number five, tooth, tooth. Okay, now check your work. Number one, knee. Number two, shoulder. Number three, stomach. 
Number four, foot. Number five, tooth. Now, let's do the sentences. Listen and write. Number one, you have two legs and two arms. You have two legs and two arms. Number two. My ten fingers are on my hands. My ten fingers are on my hands. Number three. She is wearing three rings and four earrings. She is wearing three rings and four earrings. Number four. He is not wearing mascara or lipstick. He is not wearing mascara or lipstick. Number five. His eyes are brown and his hair is black. His eyes are brown and his hair is black. Now, check your work. Number one. You have two legs and two arms. Number two. My ten fingers are on my hands. Number three. She is wearing three rings and four earrings. Number four, he is not wearing mascara or lipstick. Number five, his eyes are brown and his hair is black. Now, read the story and answer the questions about it. Read and answer. Marcy is tall and blonde. She lives in California. She is 40 years old, but she is young. Her hair is long and blonde. She is a web designer for a clothing company. Sometimes she is a model. She is slim. Her legs are long and her face is pretty. She has blue eyes. She wears a little makeup, some eyeshadow and mascara. Sometimes she wears lipstick. She likes jewelry, so she usually wears two rings, a bracelet, a watch, earrings, and a necklace. She likes to go to the theater and wears a beautiful dress and nice jewelry. At work, she wears jeans. She is a California girl. Now, listen to the questions and answer them. Number one. How old is Marcy? How old is Marcy? Number two. What does she do? What does she do? Number three. Where does she live? 
Where does she live? Number four. Is she pretty? Is she pretty? Number five. Does she have short hair? Does she have short hair? Number six. What color are her eyes? What color are her eyes? Number seven. Does she wear makeup? Does she wear makeup? Number eight. What jewelry does she wear? What jewelry does she wear? Number nine. What does she wear at the theater? What does she wear at the theater? And number 10. What does she wear at work? What does she wear at work? Now, check your answers. Number one. How old is Marcy? She is 40 years old. Number two. What does she do? She's a website designer. Sometimes she is a model. Number three. Where does she live? She lives in California. Number four. Is she pretty? Yes, she is. Number five. Does she have short hair? No, she doesn't. She has long hair. Number six. What color are her eyes? Her eyes are blue. Number seven. Does she wear makeup? Yes, she does. Number eight. What jewelry does she wear? She wears two rings, a bracelet, a watch, earrings, and a necklace. Number nine. What does she wear at the theater? She wears a beautiful dress and nice jewelry. Number 10. What does she wear at work? She wears jeans. Very good. We'll see you next time. Practicing English. Gary, thanks for coming with me today. I really need your help. That's all right. I love shopping for makeup and jewelry. I'm sort of new at this. Where should we start? Well, what color is your dress for the dance? It's black. That will look nice with your hair. Will you wear your hair up or down? I think I'll wear it up. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Shall yeah. we go in? You have beautiful skin, Angie. Thanks. Most people notice my eyes first. They're light brown. Yes, they are. Let's start with some blush here on your cheeks and some eyeliner. An eyeshadow for your eyes. What about jewelry? I think a pearl necklace and earrings would be great. Okay, let's brush up your eyebrows. See? She's looking beautiful here. She does look very beautiful. Thanks for the makeup tips. One of my roommates has a pearl necklace and earrings, so I will see what they look like after my hair is put up. Yep. What about your fingers? Sorry, Carrie, I need your chair. So, honey, what's the big occasion? 
I'm going on a date tonight with a new boy. His name is David. That's great, honey. Say, you have long, lovely fingers here. Your hands are quite lovely. What color will you use on your fingernails? I think a bright red would be great. On those hands, you're right. Your feet and toes are just as lovely as your hands, Angie. I've never had so much attention in one day. My face, eyes, lips, hands and feet look great. Now, sweetie, what color for your toenails? Have a great evening, girls. I'll come back next weekend and tell you about it. Bye. Thanks. Angie, your hair is going to look so pretty. I've had so much fun today getting all parts of my body worked on. The only thing I have missed is a massage. Well, we have a person right here at the salon who can help you. They can work on your back, neck, shoulders, hands, feet, legs, and arms. You should try a massage sometime. Thank you. That is a great idea. After all this attention, I think I'll be ready for my date. Maybe tomorrow I'll come back for a massage. That's a good idea. You will probably be out late tonight and will need a nice rest and a massage after your big night out. I'm getting a little nervous. Look at my handshake. I've got to come down, or it will ruin the whole day. Carrie, this is all very exciting for me. Getting my hair done, makeup, and jewelry. It's exciting, but right now my stomach says it's time to eat. We have time for lunch, so let's go. My feet are already starting to hurt, so let's go to a cafe and have a sandwich. Yeah, I'm tired, and my neck and shoulders hurt. Let's take a rest. The makeup girl did a great job with my makeup. I can't believe this is my face. You look great. What is your date's name? His name is David. He's a little taller than me. Very handsome. Yeah, he sounds very handsome. Carrie, I've spent all day on this getting ready for the date. I bet David only has to shave, shower, and dress. He'll be ready in just half an hour. I know.